Hey guys, just wanted to touch base really quickly because not long ago I did a post on Locks I Love which I showed three really hot, like trendy now hairdos and I talked about in that post how springtime always makes me want to get my hair cut. It makes me want to go to the salon, get some dye, get it cut and have it be all fresh for spring. And I actually did go about a week ago, and I hope that you guys can tell a little bit. Um, I kept it long. I talked in the post that maybe I'd go a little shorter. I did get, I did cut off about three inches or so, and I think I'm not sure the video is doing it justice, but um, kept the length a little bit with the three inches off. And then the ends, I don't know if you can see this, I can either flat iron these ends and make them really, really, really smooth, or my stylist actually texturized them a little bit. So I can take like some styling gel or styling cream and like zhuzh it in there and make it a little more funky. And you can't really see it, I don't have a lot of that in right now, but I went out recently, um, went out to a club, it was fun. And I got to do that and I thought my hair just looked really I don't know, a little funkier than normal. And the color, I don't know if you guys can tell, um, I went a little darker than I normally am, which I love. I still haven't gotten the nerve to go lighter. I haven't done light in such a long time. Uh, maybe, maybe I'll do that in a couple months when I go back. But what my stylist did, and I'll just go ahead and say, her name is Catherine, and the salon I go to, if you're familiar with Richmond, it's in Carytown, and it's a, it's a salon called Karina's. And I love it, and I've met, I met Catherine a few before Christmas so I've seen her a few times and I love going there and I love her I love how she styles my hair um, what she did with the color is she did an all over dark but when she took her brush and was like painting it on she left uh, pieces of my natural hair color so that I would have a little bit more dimension and a little bit more depth and like I said I don't think you can see it on camera but when the Sun hits it it looks really cool it looks like I have a couple different shades of color in here so, I don't know, I just wanted to give them a little shout out too because I love them so much. And I also wanted to talk about two new products. They are from Bumble and Bumble. And here are the samples. Um, this is the Let It Shine and it's a sample that Catherine gave me of the shampoo and conditioner. This is brand new out by Bumble and Bumble and I can't wait to try it. I've used Bumble and Bumble products for a long time now. I use their straight product. I actually used that this morning. I've used some of their other shine sprays. I've used their surf spray. Um, she gave me this sample. I can't wait. It's Like I said, it's brand new out. And then another thing, another product that they just unveiled is the Bumble and Bumble Texture. It's called the Hair Undressing Cream. Um, she gave me a couple of these to try. And I plan on coming back sooner than later, hopefully, and letting you guys know how what I think about these two. But I will say, she used this on me in the salon, and I loved it. So I'm excited about these. Um, thank you, Catherine, for giving me the samples for my awesome hair. And I don't know, I just wanted to touch base and let you guys know that I actually did get my hair cut, because I know I made that post a long time ago. And um, I don't know, maybe next time I'll be lighter or something. Who knows? Maybe I'll have bangs. Maybe I'll go short again. I'm not sure. You never know with me. So thanks for watching and I'll talk to you guys soon. Bye.